Hi, my infinite beings. I'm Infinite B, and in this video, I'm going to talk to you guys about manifesting what you want in this life, in this reality. Yes, I'm going to be speaking about law of attraction tips that I've used that have helped me manifest whatever I want. So for me, manifesting can mean anything, you guys. Like, I literally can tell the universe that I want something and I'm going to have it. And that's the type of uh, resistance-free confidence that you need. No resistance whatsoever. That's the main way to attract. A lot of people are saying, oh, you got to feel this. You got to put a vision board. You got to do that. Yes, all of that is true. And those are things that help you. But if there is resistance, you will not obtain what you want because that resistance is going to counter whatever you're trying to manifest in your life. So you got to know that you're going to have it. Like you got to be cocky with it. This is how I was able to manifest my Mercedes Benz, able to manifest my Rolex watch. This is how I'm able to manifest these things because I know without a shadow of a doubt that I'm getting that. I know without a shadow of a doubt that I will have those things. And physical objects to me is like so easy to manifest because I look at it like water. I look at it like it's just an abundance of it out there and I'm just going to end up attracting it to me. That's how you have to look at it, you guys. You have to look at it as you're worthy of that first to begin. There's an abundance of it secondly and third you're going to have it that's how you have to be in order to manifest because you're not going to be able to manifest these things that you want in your life if you don't feel like that oh what about the simple things like the everyday things i manifest things every single day like i can think okay i need detergent and next thing i know like my man is like i'm in target what do you need and i'm like detergent it's to that point where like even me thinking about it will attract it and i know that sounds crazy but that's like the resistance free um vibe that i'm sending out to the universe i know most people are going to say don't say i need or anything like that but because i'm so resistance free i can just be like oh we need juice well, we need, you know, dishwash detergent. That just happens um, with dishwash detergent. So that's how I, you know, in my mind, I'm so like aligned, I guess. My whole being is aligned with the universe that I can just think of something like, oh, okay. I'm thinking to actually go get it myself and then somebody just brings it. Like, I, this is the way I manifest so many free things, I guess, in my life too, is because as soon as I think of it or as soon as I realize it's not there and I need it, it's like the universe just sends it to me instantaneously. And it's crazy. It's so weird, you guys. Like when you start manifesting at this level, it's crazy. But for now, you're trying to manifest. Don't say, I need this, I need that. Just say, I have this, I have that, I am this, I am that. Okay? If you want to have, let's say, $10,000 because that's easy to manifest. I know for some people, all right, let me just say $1,000. If you want $1,000 um, in your bank account today, like you may have resistance to it if you're not used to having money or whatever, but once you get used to a certain amount of money, $1,000 is not really gonna be hard to manifest. You're gonna be like, okay, I need $1,000. And then next thing you know, $1,000 is gonna come to you some kind of way. And you have to just know that it's gonna come to you. Like the universe is gonna send it to you and it can be in mysterious ways, like, seriously the universe works like that i'm telling you um but you have to believe that it's going to happen and you have to know that you're going to attract what you are saying that you're going to attract you cannot have any resistance to it because if you have resistance like if you feel like uh i'm not gonna have that money or like say for instance you go to a store and like you're swiping your card and stuff if you're watching every little thing that you buy and pay for and stuff like that those type of things send the universe out a signal that you don't have enough money and it's gonna keep giving you the same so you have to like live in abundance literally like when i go to stores i just swipe and i'm just like okay i just get everything i need and i just swipe and I never have to worry about money because I know I'm always going to have and money is just going to keep coming into my account and coming into my account before I could even get to spend it. Yeah, money's just going to keep coming to you, coming to you. You're going to have money coming to you in all different ways. So out of nowhere, for instance, my dad came and brought me $100. I had no clue he was going to give me $100. I hadn't seen my dad in like two months. And I'm like, okay, all of a sudden he's bringing me $100. He texts me like, oh, I'm going to. And in that same morning, I was actually saying my money affirmations. If you don't listen to abundance affirmations, you need to start listening to those because that is going to help you guys. That's going to help you be able to manifest money if you want to manifest money. If you want to manifest a mate in your life, anything, there's affirmations for it. Um, 
So that's what you can do to manifest those things in your life. Um, and I do this for every single thing that I need. It's crazy. I don't ask. I, it's just like people just are going to keep giving you and giving you and giving you. It's crazy. The universe is going to keep on giving you things, you guys. And you have to believe it. You have to believe that you're going to have these things and that you're going to attract these things. So I know you guys are probably like, okay, how can I attract like you know things in my life that aren't material items how can i attract the mate in my life i've done this like i've literally done this so when i got out of my last relationship i kept saying to that to the universe like i'm going to have someone who treats me great who adores me i kept saying these things kept saying them kept saying them no despite how bad my last relationship ended um i still was sending this out to the universe because i knew without a shadow of a doubt that i deserved a great man in my life it's crazy because he was already in my life <laughs> i already had manifested him i guess previously um but he was just my friend so when the time came it was just like it clicked like this both of us are single right now like it was like we, it can't be because he was with someone and I was with someone. So it just happened where like it just clicked and it was like aligned. I'm telling you guys, it's like the stars were aligned. You have to put that out into the universe. You cannot say, oh, this person, you know, men are crap or women are crap, whatever, whatever. You can't say these things because that's what the universe is going to pick up on. And the universe is going to say, oh, okay, she doesn't really want somebody because she's saying all men are crap. Or he doesn't really want somebody because he's saying all women are crap. You got to make sure that you're sending out that vibration to the universe that you deserve the best. You deserve someone great for you. And that person will come to you and make their way to you. So on top of all of that, you guys, you guys can write this stuff down. I talked about it in a previous video. I will link it here. Um, but you can script this stuff out. You can literally write as if you are a professor of a university and write as if you are, you know, a, a wife or, you know, a mother of three kids, a mother of twin girls, like whatever you want, you can literally write it out. And as if that is your reality right now, and what the universe is going to do is catch up with what you're writing. It's crazy. I know it sounds like out there, but it works. I've done this so many times. Like, I have a journal that I keep where I've scripted so much stuff and when I go back and read it, it gives me goosebumps. I scripted out my Benz. My Mercedes Benz, I scripted out too. On top of putting it on my vision board, I scripted that. I scripted that I had that car. Like, I'm telling you guys, like, you can script for these things and the universe is going to meet what you're writing. Write in the present tense, write it as if it is right now or it already happened. Like, oh, I had so much fun on my trip to Dubai. Write it out. Like, I had so much fun on my trip to Italy. Like, the universe is going to be like, oh, she went to Italy? All right, she's going to Italy. I'm telling you, it's crazy. I know it sounds crazy, but it's real. I cannot stress this enough. Like, you just have to believe. You have to believe this stuff. Because I have so much stuff in that book that when I read it, I'm literally getting goosebumps. I'm literally crying. Because I'm like, oh my God, I manifested this, 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 and this. And sometimes I forget what I script. So that's why when I write it down, I close that up and I forget all about it. But once it comes and I go back and look at my book every now and again, like every maybe six months, I'll go back and look at the old stuff. And I'm like, oh my God, I scripted this. And I manifested this and I manifested that trip and I manifested this and I manifested that. Like, it's just crazy to see. So you can script. You want to make sure that you're writing in the present tense or the past tense. Don't write it as if it didn't happen yet. Write it as if it happened already or it's happening right now. Like, I so love my new house. I love my dining room, my movie theater room. Like, I'm telling you, you write this stuff out. Like, the universe has no choice but to meet that expectation. You want to make sure that you're expressing gratitude. The universe loves gratitude. So expressing gratitude, giving thanks, and being grateful for the things you currently have and the things that you wish to obtain. Yes, you can actually say thank you for things that you don't literally have because the universe is going to be like, okay, I got to get that to her. So I've actually thanked the universe for a job when I was completely unemployed and lo and behold, two months later, had that job. And I give gratitude for the things that I have. And sometimes when I'm tested and I feel like, all right, the universe is testing me right now, it's testing my patience, um, 
let me give thanks so i start saying thank you for this water in the shower when i'm taking a shower thank you for this everything thank you for this bed thank you for the ability to walk thank you for the air that i breathe every single thing i'm um, just be thankful just thank the universe for a bunch of stuff that you have that you're grateful for there are so many things to be grateful for you guys like i'm telling you i can literally write a list like every single day when i wake up i'm thanking the universe and you have to do this throughout your day as well like make sure you're giving gratitude gratitude is a must like the song goes by coffee i love that song but yes gratitude is a must okay give gratitude give thanks you have to give thanks like it works like a charm the universe loves gratitude the universe is gonna be like hmm she's so grateful let me give her more saying thank you for the things you have now and the universe is going to keep giving you more and more and more to be grateful for to be thankful for so make sure you're expressing gratitude that's one thing that i do with everything it could be a cup of water thank you so much for this water i know it seems crazy but that's how i live in abundance that's how i always have because the universe is like oh she's so grateful i don't just say thank you on thanksgiving when most people say thank you no i'm saying thank you thank you all day long every day once you get into this practice, it's so easy to attract things into your life. It's so easy to have every single thing that you need. Ooh. Make sure that you guys are, are doing that, you guys. Make sure you're giving thanks because the universe loves gratitude. So the universe is going to give you the things that you want. Just believe. That's all you got to do. Believe that you're going to have it and you're going to have it. Like believe without a shadow of a doubt. Like seriously, sometimes you guys put faith in the wrong things. Like you put faith in your teams to win the playoffs or whatever it is that you want them to win. But you need to put that much faith in yourself to be able to attract whatever you want. Put that much faith in the universe because I'm telling you, it will happen. It will happen for you. There's nothing that I cannot have. I may not have it right this minute and it's in the works. I know it's in the works because I can see. Like, you know, I can see it and I'm like... I already know I got that. I got this. Like, I smile sometimes going to bed because I can see. I envision my house. Like, I'm very visual. So, I can literally see how my inside of my house looks, how the countertops look, how everything looks. And I know I'm going to end up manifesting this exact house that I keep seeing in my mind. Like, in my mind's eye. I keep seeing this exact house that I want. And I know I'm going to manifest that. So, <laughs> stay tuned for that update when I do manifest that house. Like, but I know it's in the works. Like, that's what, what sometimes you got to feel like, okay, I know it's in the works. Like, you may not have it right this minute. And that's not, just not having it right this minute is not proof that it's not on its way. It's on its way. It's in your vortex. Like, Abraham Hicks always talks about that. So, make sure you check her out too. It's in your vortex. There's so many things in my vortex that I can see. And I know it's there. I'm like, hey, I see you. I see you. You, got, you cannot be attached to when. And you cannot be attached to how. Just know it's coming. Just know that it is coming. And it's on its way. That's the best advice I could give you guys. Know that it's on its way. Know that it's coming. Don't worry about the when. Don't worry about the how. Just know what you want. Let the universe know. And let it take care of the rest. And you will have exactly what you want in life. And I know many people are going to say, oh, it's not all about material things or physical objects. I understand there are some people that do not care about any of this stuff kudos to them i'm talking to the people that want to manifest in their life and they want to live an abundant life because there's no rule that says you need to live like a pauper there's no rule that says you need to feel guilty for things that you have there's nothing like that the universe is abundant like there is massive amounts of resources despite what anyone is telling you and all you have to do is give gratitude you know say that you're gonna have these things know that you're gonna have these things feel like you're gonna have these things and you're gonna have whatever it is that you want like seriously that's how simple it is all right my infinite beings i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you liked it give it a big thumbs up make sure you subscribe so you can be part of my family my infinite beings and i will see you guys in my next video bye